Hi, my name is Luz. My full name is Molus Bloetjes. I'm coming from the Netherlands. I'm living close by the sea. And I've been painting since I was 24. And oh, I was really like, I don't know how to work with um, paint and brushes and things like that. And a friend of mine, uh, he was giving me a box of oil paint and I started and what came out was amazing to me because I found parts in myself, I found that particular color that I was having in me. I really love that thing because I, I, I didn't get that with drawing. I've been drawing a lot in my life. This was really a new thing to me, the, the fluency of the colors, the mixing uh, and, and finding that imaginary world that I have in my mind, I could put it on the canvas. So within a little while, uh, people asked me to do an exhibition. Uh, one was in uh, a restaurant in my hometown and another one was in a hospital in Amsterdam. So it was very cool. And that's the point where I actually started to take myself seriously as an artist. Uh, so I, I wanted to have some education, not for the techniques because I'm a self-taught uh, person and I, I wanted to keep that very vulnerable imaginary world. So I needed someone who had the same style like me, who was working from the heart, from visions uh, and I found her in an elderly woman. Uh, she's living close to me and she was giving lessons and she just uh, inspires me with her own work, uh, which is a bit like I think Rotko uh, style, that's a Dutch painter. Um, and there are a lot of Dutch and Belgian and Danish uh, people. Uh, we get a lot of inspiration from that. Uh, kind of painters. Um, well, this one is, I've made it with acrylic because the woman uh, where I have my lessons, she's working with acrylic. So I had to turn from oil to acrylic. In this one, you can see the colors are not that bright, but they are uh, formed by layer, layer, layer over layer. I'm also using a lot of structure like this thing. Uh, this is paper. And I've done it with uh, um, like paper you have in a shoe box or that's wrapped around shoes. And, and this is the result and you get a lot of structure. Um, halfway a painting, there are a lot of figures coming up. Like um, here, she is coming up. Um, I can't help that. It's just um, the amazing things um, that are happening when you're painting. Um, I will do this a little more behind so that you can see the whole story. I have here another painting. Um, uh, this one is a story called Angels. This one, and she is uh, an angel with a dress of real, uh, uh, real uh, fabrics. And here, uh, her wings are also from fabrics. And I think my paintings are reflecting me, and I am what I, how I live, is reflected in my painting. I had with. Um, this work behind me and it's a very old one um well i have something with paintings falling on the ground i guess because uh, actually this painting was standing with a hand like this the, the thing there that's a hand uh well there um and it was like this and then the painting fell on the ground and it was like wow it's much cooler if i turn it around <laughs> so um it was upside down and it stayed that way because then it became a giving hand and that was actually exactly the insight that I had at that moment. What is my goal in being an artist? I really like to be painting with others and to follow my heart and my inner visions and to stay true to myself. In that way of working, I want to give that to others that they can do that as well. Thank you.